everybody welcome back to pink crafty world today i have the reveal of uh, my new craft area and i'm here hope um that some of you guys actually connect to this uh, life and in the meantime and where we see if somebody else show up i'm gonna um connect my um microphone hey. so if anybody is watching and wanted to say hello maybe you guys hear noises now because i'm trying to connect the microphone but um yeah if you are here say hello um i'm going to start for um this area i'm going to start um let me turn the uh, camera so you guys can see um i'm going to start from this area and i'm going to give like a 360 um around so you guys can see that's the door to get into the room and um over here i have my sewing machine area here it's some of my many craft items and i'm going to be moving uh, like that so you guys can see and if you are watching you want to say hello uh, that will help so I know that um, you guys are there you guys are watching and again welcome to pink crafty world um, and that's me over there hello everybody how are you guys so here is my craft table that's how everything is looking so far over here is my desk area that's my one of my cards um the closet hi carmen how are you <laughs> um that's the closet and the closet is a lot of stuff um here it's more items and i'm sorry if i'm making you guys dizzy it's not intended you know it's not in purpose or anything like that but i want you guys to have like a a you know see how everything looks and then we're gonna go through each area uh hi created chica halls how are you um I'm doing my craft room tour, my new craft area. And um, yeah, now I'm going to start over here. And like I said, this is my entrance area to my room. I uh, don't pay attention to the back. The back is there because when I buy a lot of stuff that needs to come up here, I take, I put everything in the back and then I bring them up. Um, so that's why I always keep that back there. Um, starting over here, this is an organizer and, uh, I have that for a long time. I never use it. It was, I, um, get it a few months ago. I finally take it out of the packaging and I decide that I can use it in the craft room and yeah, to store all my punchers. Um, they are all in there and also things like that that size that says shoes love it's uh from my previous uh decor in my previous um craft room and then i of course bring my uh wooden uh stamps which i have much more than that but um i just keep uh, when i move to um, up here to the other room that i was i decide to keep um 
the ones that I love the most. So these ones and all the ones that I have is the ones that I love the most. So yes, um, and they're there. I like to display those because I, I think they're cute and I like the, the designs on them. So continuing, um, it's six people watching. So hi, say hi, and thank you for watching. Um, over here, this is just uh, decor. Uh, those Barbies that I have there, they are vintage. That's why um, they are here uh, being part of the craft room. And I do like them so much. Hi, Kim. How are you, Kim? Um, so those are swans. I love swans. I think they are so beautiful. So I have these five swans and um in here i have um some um, little canvases vintage canvases some um charms in there um in this one i have um the wooden pieces that i was talking to uh carmen today actually i was talking about those because she make a beautiful project uh, with hers um, then that bag it's uh, when I go downstairs and have to sew anything or work on, in any projects from my bedroom or my living room I take that bag in here in this uh, black organizer it's a lot of jewelry making things um, I don't make jewelry itself um, so um, different you know things for um, yeah, making embellishments and different things like that. Um, I've been moving a lot of the stuff to another containers. Um, but yeah, that's uh, pretty much what is in in this container. I don't know if I show this one. These are adhesive remover from Krylon. So yes. Okay, so that's how the area looks. Moving a little bit forward, I have more decor. All of you guys know that I love, love, love unicorns and things like that. Cutesy things. I like uh, unicorns. I like um, flamingos. I have my cute flamingo here. Look at her. How cute she is. Isn't she cute? Um, and in here... All these are the sequins uh, from Tuesday morning. I have some sparkling glitter from Target over here. Um, Krista, hi Krista, how are you? Um, I have this calendar, it's out of date, of course, <laughs> but it's there, that's from the Dollar Tree. And here I have this box and the car was from my friend Lisa and I uh, have paper clips and binder clips here. Um, also over here it's more sequins and more uh, confetti um, pieces and those containers I have them for a very very long time. And the lid was red, so I decided to uh, spray paint the lids in color pink and use them for some of my uh, sequins. So that's how that there looks. Um, let me see. Okay. So then in here, I have this roll of this uh, mesh trim. <laughs> oh, <how> great stuff. <laughs> um, and here I have everything that is re related to sewing. That's uh, my sewing machine. And this is the sewing table. And underneath there, I have uh, my sewing box. And then I have like some sewing materials here in the blue basket. Um, yeah, it doesn't look too cute, but um, yeah, here have like pieces of fabrics and 
other knickknacks and things that I need that I use sometimes. Same thing over here. I have uh, pieces of fabrics. Uh, um, I like to uh, make uh, snippets and things like that. This is thread. Um, here's one of my bobbins with thread. And over here is more thread. This organizer, very cute. My niece uh, gifted to me a few months ago. And it was perfect for my thread. So I have it there. Um, my sewing machine, the one that I have is um, my brother, uh, Project Runaway Limited Edition. And that's how it looks, but of course I have to make a cover for all my equipment. <laughs> and uh, because you know I keep everything very clean in this room, but I have asthma, so it has to be uh, away from dust or anything like that. These pictures here are from Dollar Tree. Husband, bring me those. Thank you, Hobby, for bringing me those. They are so cute, and I put them there. And then um, continuing here. Over here, we have that there, more unicorns and rainbows, and it's so cute. Okay, let's start. From over here, be always happy. That's a sign. Uh, I love that sign. I got that very long time ago. Um, these are uh, dress forms that I have here. I uh, paint those and decorate them with the flowers. And this is a flower that my friend Lisa sent me. Tassels. Um, Dana sent me tassels. Tassels that I make. Uh, my friend Sandra from Canada. From Sandra's Hall. She gifted me that uh, keychain from Canada. Um, these are ones that I did get. Some of the people just gifted me. Different type of things. Um, this here is from Target and it's all full and my uh, my chunk glitters, different colors. So I have that there. Um, these are from Dollar Tree and this one is from Hobby Lobby. And I also have the mermaid sign there from the Dollar Tree. The boxes here, I know a lot of you guys remember I altered those boxes with the Maggie Holmes papers, different collections, and those are the ones that I get at Hobby Lobby for, I think, two dollars and some cents, and they are the nicest uh, organizers that anybody can have. I just love them. You can fit a lot of stuff in them, and I just love it. Here I have this plush unicorn the husband gave me. And this I get it at a Goodwill for a couple of bucks not too long ago. And sometimes when I'm sitting over here, I like to listen to music or, you know, the radio or anything like that or podcast or anything like that. So I like to put my phone there and just listen, you know, have some noise in the background. And um, that's what I do. <laughs> um this has all the um, recollections, specialty glitters that I haul from Michaels and yeah, and beads. These are from the Little Birdie. These are from Recollection and um, sequence and things from um, Recollection from Michaels. Here is another um, dress form with. Um, you know more tassels and more um, things that you guys uh, some of you guys send me some I buy and things like that so yeah um, inside this I think inside this one oh I have a bunch of these and um, this is not cotton this is called another type of material but you guys see it's different colors there and I also have uh, my uh, applicates, different applicates that I get at Hobby Lobby. So I have a bunch of them there. So when I need it, they're there and I just have to grab them. 
Then in the bottle, bottom, I have um, these um, keychains from Dollar Tree and em embellishments and things that you guys, some of you guys send me. Um, same thing over here. I have em embellishments over here. Uh, these are the rosettes my friend Anna from Anna's Handmade Creations sent me. So I put those there so they don't get damaged or anything. And in the bottom here, I have like some glitters and some sequins and things like that. Um, over here I have wax. Uh, uh, what is it called? This? Uh, the, the seal, the wax seals. Um, I have these banners. Um, the wax melt for the wax seal and things like that just and then um, I don't know if I can open this one in the bottom but that one has um, tools from spell binders and different tools and uh, paper clips and this for the cutting um, mats that I have and things things to just to craft uh then in this area in this area it's uh for little knickknacks and my washi tapes um and i have here of course i have my pom-pom trim that i didn't turn on my pom-poms today there we go look how cute they light up and there I have more macaroons. I have erasers, donut erasers. These uh, flowers, I make them. And it actually goes like that with the butterfly. I make those and um, I have my washi. I have this piece of decor. Um, it was from the Disney store. Hi, Scary Carrie, how are you? And there is my washi. They are completely full. I have like a little space for maybe one or two rolls, but not much. This cutesy here, it's uh, from uh, Carmen. Thank you, Carmen, again for that cutesy because it's so, so cute. I have inside this cup a uh, hand sanitizer and I have this thermometer. I don't know why, but it's there, so... <laughs> I have uh, hand sanitizer everywhere in the house. So um, then down here, I have these uh, candles. Says hello, gorgeous from Dollar Tree. And then I have my uh, doll set there that I hold that. Oh my God, a long time ago, uh, one of the Goodwills or maybe um, I can't remember exactly where it was. Um, oh, you have the fridge also. <laughs> yeah, my husband, uh, give me that one for Christmas, uh, this last Christmas. And it, we get one in color black and a red one. The red one was intended to be for my daughter, but then she said, no, I want the black one. So I ended up with the, the red one. So it's fine. I'm happy. It works very nice. You know, um, uh, in the second floor in the house, so I don't have to keep going down there to get, you know, any type of uh, water or drinks or anything. I try to keep water. That's mainly what I drink, but um, here I have more washi tapes in this cute Hello Kitty. I'm also very uh, fan of Hello Kitty, even though I don't have too many things. I think I have like two or three things here, but I love Hello Kitty. And more washi tapes. I have that from the Dollar Tree. Here is another one of the dolls. And then here I keep um, those confettis was uh, my friend Dana who sent those to me. So thank you, Dana. And oh my God, they last so much because I've been using them in packaging. And I still have a lot of that. I thought... Uh, those are the ones from Target and I thought that, you know, they don't going to have too much on them, but they do. <laughs> so, yeah. 
and that's how it look i have that love sign then here like i was talking i have the mini fridge which i love to have here and then over here i have this cute um a spool unicorn spool with the washi tape i can't remember who gifted that to me and i'm going to Oh, excuse me for that. My brain goes blank all the time. I think it was Sue Age who actually sent it, send that to me. The erasers back there was my friend Lisa um, from the Heart Studio. Uh, or made new to create, <laughs> like a lot of us know her. Um, I love um, Winnie the Pooh in my last... Um, craft room i have a lot of my winnie the pooh when i move to this one i decide to put them away again because that's what i do i like to change so i put a lot of them away but i keep ear here because this piece is very very heavy you guys don't have an idea how much this little piece weight literally it, it weighs like maybe eight pounds easily it's, it's very heavy so yeah that's how this area looks and then in the bottom uh, i have a lot of stuff like um well i have these uh vintage dolls and i i love the way they look they don't have clothes on them but they're so cute i found them in the goodwill one day and i decided to keep them i have um uh, no mini notebooks uh back there um, I have those pads to take notes and things, and I like to use those for my traveler's, um, notebooks that I make, that I create sometimes. Um, so I have different kinds in here. Um, I have balls for packaging, um, these, uh, postage, uh, postcards, um, you see those uh, memo pads, mermaids. These was sent to me by my friend uh, Dana. Thank you, Dana. And um, yeah, have a bunch of different stuff here. I like these uh, vintage uh, books. I have team holds. I have tassels here. I have these uh, car holders. Back there, I have some cane company embellishments, and um, I love them, so I'm being hoarding them for a while. Um, here I have these wooden um, sticks and more wooden pieces here. Um, banners from Recollection. These embellishments from Julique Boutiques and things like that. Uh, more Team Holtz items in here. These uh, notepads from Dollar Tree. A sticky notes from Dollar Tree. Um, I had a bunch of vintage books here like this one in here. And I'm sorry, guys, if you guys cannot see very good, but I'm trying to talk to hold the camera and my back is hurting. So, yeah, more sticky notes and things. Uh, my all hearts um, cards there. I have these um, that I use sometimes for shakers. Um, and in the bottom here, I shared with you guys before that I... That's how I organize all my punch board um, items. And uh, the binder in the corner, the bottom corner, has the instructions on how to use the boards. Yes, they're self-explanatory, and now I just have to grab them and use them. But in case I forgot one day how, you know, the measurements and all that, I like to keep them in the binder. Um, I have my letter punch board there, um, an organizer. It's in the bottom. Uh, I have the letter organ um, punch in the bottom. I have 
the binder, puncher, there. A lot of different ones. Uh, my happy jig and all those other ones. So, yeah. Then over here, I have my birdcage uh, that I altered a uh, very long time ago. And it's, it's with me for years now. And it's so cute. Um, that's how it looks. I altered that piece and I hang it from there. And here I have more of the Hello Kitty stuff. And then in this organizer here, um, those are meant to be like for screws and things in the garage probably. But I paint it and I use it to organize like wooden pieces, um, my handmade flowers that I made. Um, when I make rosettes, they are, I put them in there. Um, different embellishments, bowls and things like that. Too. So I have them ready in there, ready to go. So when I need to use them, they are there. Here in this caddy has all my Sharpie um, in different colors. Um, there, um, this here is so sparkly and I use it sometimes for embellishment. So yeah. The mermaid's um, box is uh, stencils, and that was sent to me by Lisa. And the 24 puzzle piece of mermaid there, uh, that was a gift from my husband. And that is from my friend Mary Salvedo. Hey, Mary, thank you. And then here is this uh, vintage. Um, cassette tape organizer and what I did is I painted it and I use it to put all my sequins in there so they're all sorry sequin on my ribbons all my my I, I keep saying sequins all my ribbons are in there different colors I it was better organized but you know I have to I keep taking it out put new ones in and just it's, it's a mess but this is the reality. It's not a perfect room. You don't gonna see an uh, IKEA craft room because no, I'm very happy uh, with what I got. That cute box is a vintage box and I have all my fairy uh, garden uh, things that I'm been holding, uh, the bottom one with the dogs. And then that box on top, you're getting a hint of what is gonna come up that is the, uh, Giveaway for this channel for the 3,000 uh, subscriber giveaway. Um, it's going to be a challenge giveaway. So stay tuned for that. I'm waiting for uh, another things that I ordered. And I'm still waiting for it. But that's coming up soon. I'm going to make the, announce, uh, the announcement very, very soon here in the channel. So uh, you get a hint what is in the box. The box is full already. But it's going to come more stuff going to be there. Um, then I have a window here and I put these pretty curtains and I got the uh, hanging butterfly that I get from uh, Hobby Lobby and um, yeah that's that's how they look and guys I'm sorry if I cannot um, if I if I'm not reading what you guys are um, oh my god what I did here Oh my goodness. I don't know what happened. Uh, ay, ay, ay. Okay. Wait a minute, guys. Um, is the camera went crazy on me. <laughs> don't do that, please. Um, but up there, my husband put me one of the shelves that was in another room. And I have some of my unicorns there. I love them. Love, love my unicorns. And I was talking about the uh, garland, the, the butterfly garland that I have here in this window. Uh, finally, it's sunny outside. It was snowing all morning. Um, then it's another uh, floating shelf here, which I have my um, fairy. And then the Christmas tree here. Um, some of you guys might remember
remember that when uh, I shared that because that was sent to me this Christmas um, from my friend uh, Sue H. Hi Sue, I know she will be watching this and uh, then I have this organizer here and um, I paint it white and there I have those uh, ribbon trims from uh, Hobby Lobby and uh, here I have the boxes uh, from Dollar Tree and oh, this get a stuck in my shirt so one second <laughs> here what I have is um, you know things like this that I can use in my crafting um, flat back pearls and all those knickknacks that we accumulate <laughs> throughout the years of crafting yeah here it's another of my fairies and then I have this um, floral piece that I love so much because it's pink and it looks so cute and then I have a candle and this is very old but I love um, the way this tint box looks so I have to have it then more of those then here I uh, have more of the trims um, this pencil holder and I have trim there and all those tiny trims from Hobby Lobby and this organizer open like that and yeah more trims here and more of these organizers there and more trims in the bottom um i'm hoping you guys can hear me good um let me know if you guys i know you guys are watching and you guys probably are not even typing anything but just in case uh, if i don't read you it's because i'm being busy showing you know um this here I have a video on this card. Um, it didn't change as much. Uh, the card didn't change as much. Um, this is all my planners, uh, organizer, and all my planners, and my sticker books, and my paper clips, and my favorite pens to work in my planners are here. Um, and I love um, this beautiful clip here. Um, that was sent to me by my friend Anna Handmade Creations. Hi Anna, thank you so much. And um, I've been decorating my cards with a bunch of um, the magnets uh, from Dollar Tree. Every time I see a cute one, um, I grab it and I just decorate my card. Oops, one fall off. Um, I decorate my cards with them. Um, this here, that pumpkin, um, it's a, um, wax melt burner thing. And yeah, uh, right now it's not plugged in because I have to find a way how to plug that in. Then, um, I'm going to move over here. Um, and let me move the chair. Th this is my desk and this desk was brown and... I decide to paint it and I think I did a really good job huh? and I love that I put the handles of course in pink because that's my favorite color and yeah that's how my um, desk actually looks I love it I have my laptop here and I have my mouse of course it's my pink flamingo <laughs> have this organizer here and then I have um, those um, pens organizers there I get these at Hobby Lobby for oh my god very very cheap um, I think I removed the price yeah but it was um, less than two dollars for those acrylic holders and um, yeah I have that at um, the frame with the clips here i got this um this piece i got it that's my son <laughs> my daughter and i got that piece at 
big lots and I love it because it's like a very uh, unicorn rainbow colors and I love the colors then the other day I found this at um, Dollar Tree the calendar and I hang it there for now um, until I found a place where I wanted to put it um, those organizers that are holding the pens are from the Dollar Tree um, this I don't gonna even mention how this uh, the name of this container is because I can pronounce that word but um, this ha has a bunch of my erasers I love to collect these cute tiny erasers and yeah I'm like a little kid and I don't care you know then I have my vintage uh, typewriter here and I love that vintage uh, typewriter it's so cute love the color love the way it looks there so I'm in love here is my mini misty and this is a gift from my friend uh, Gloria Martinez hi Gloria thank you so much um, this piece, I found it at a Goodwill, um, right before I moved to this room and I painted it and I did the, uh, unicorn part, all that I redo, I redo the whole, uh, piece. I paint this, um, uh, where the, um, tags go here. This I painted in color gold. Um, I found the word create at Hobby Lobby. And then with my Cricut, I cut the, uh, the name of my channel, Pink Crafty World. And then I put the butterflies from Hobby Lobby that I also find it like for 69 cents, 70 cents, something like that in sale. So yeah, those uh, shadow boxes I made myself that's unicorn and this one over here it's a uh, mermaid and you guys probably remember when i shared them in the channel but that's how that one looks and then this here with uh, some of the ribbon and the washi are from uh the we are memory keepers and i get those at tuesday morning and yeah it's for washi and ribbons and uh, those have some uh, binder clips. Um, there in the middle, I forgot to mention, that's uh, my uh, paper clips. I have a bunch of paper clips there. Um, yeah. In the drawers in my desk, I don't have um, too many things I have. This uh, has all my adhesive. Uh, adhesive that, this uh, runner adhesive. My double-sided tapes, it's pretty much double-sided tapes and the uh, foam mounting that, uh, dots and stuff like that. Here is a mess. I have a bunch of glue sticks from Dollar Tree, uh, batteries, uh, staples, jute. Um, then in the bottle, it's the bottom, it's um, these lights, more batteries, and uh, a bunch of um, hot glue guns that I have that they work and I don't gonna throw them away if they work you know uh, then in this middle one I have a hairbrush uh, have tools um, wire jewelry wire tape <laughs> it's a little bit of everything here my hairbrush is there because sometimes if I you know I'm up here and I don't want to go down there I use my hairbrush up here um, here I have napkins and these napkins are from my napkin swap that I, uh, my friends uh, Sue H host not too long ago then I have cupcake liners in here sometimes I use them for rosettes um, this one has cards a bunch of cards if I don't make cards at least I have those on hand then I have this set of pens and a, a tripod, um, a selfie stick, and things like that. <laughs> um, another, um, we are memory keeper organizer thing is this. Then over here is my siren. It's a very old, but it still works. 
it has adhesive on and yes i love that thing um let me go up in that shelf i have my um oh my god the flamingo um my husband gifted to me last year the heart it turns on it works but i forgot to turn it on guys so um then i have here my printer this container here i have some of the embellishment that i'm being creating and then i have um the journals um this one was made by lisa thank you lisa for the beautiful um journal again oops and um it's so cute and then my friend gloria oh no sorry no gloria margarita <laughs> margarita sent me this one sorry margarita thank you so much it's very pretty and this one i made myself um then um here is my new brush that I share with you guys for my dyes. Let me put it up here. Um, in here, I have die cuts and die cuts that you guys send me sometimes in friend mail. Um, I put them in there. I have a tripod that I like to use in this desk. And um, in there, I have um, those boxes. They have a lot of the die cut, the, not die cut, the ephemera uh, for some of the collections I have there. Um, it's completely full of different collections ephemera. So I'm not going to go in detail for that because we're going to need like 500 hours here in this craft room. And yeah, I, it's going to be hard. But um, then in this area here, those organizers i get them at rose at ross and i have all my dies and my stamps in these um organizers um here are all the i get from my design team from in love art shop and aliexpress spell binders Sizzix, um Doris, uh, Cotterbug, I have some We Are Memory Keepers, more of the spell binders, and yeah. Um, down here, it's tonics, it's momenta. Um, oh, God, artsy, and oh my goodness, Bo Bonnie, uh, Crafter Companion, all that fun stuff and they it works very nice and here it's more dice i have my coco and reno in the back um i have my uh embossing uh folders in the back coco and reno's and then these are the um the big die from and the six slits from sizzix and here I just organized my stamps and I love how nice they look because they're organized and cute. Um, I get these um, uh, bags, I can call it, from um, Amazon and I put them in here so they all look very nice. Some of them in the back are not like this one, I didn't open it yet. So I, and it has dies, so I decide not to, um, you know, open it yet. But uh, these are the bags that I get uh, from um, Amazon uh, to organize dies and stamps. So, and I put them in the back, so I have them there and I know, you know, that's how, that's where they go and all that. Here it's another window and then on top there is those, um, the willow tree was sent to me by my bestie Carmen. Thank you, Carmen. Um, those was gifted to me last year. Uh, my daughter uh, gifted those for Valentine's. Everything. Oh, thank you. 
Who was that? That's Kimberly. <laughs> Thank you, Kimberly. Um, and I have that other bottle. It's so cute. I buy the battery finally. I had to put the battery. That was my bestie Carmen and the cutesy, cutesy fairy there. Look how cute she is. It's from my uh, bestie Carmen. Thank you, Carmen, for that. Um, okay. Then what else? Okay. Then, hi, this is me. <laughs> this is uh, me doing this uh, a room tour. Oh, I forgot to talk about the chair because I'm so proud of this chair because this chair, I got this from the Goodwill in the box. And I was like, oh, maybe I can get it. You know, maybe it don't gonna work. It piece missing came and put it together and yeah, it's there. And when I opened the box, I was like, oh my God, surprise, it's pink. How nice, you know? Um, then I have, there is a closet because this used to be my daughter's room. And I have a closet there. And I'm going to open the closet, but don't be, don't be scared, guys. Um, here, those are from my old craft room. I have those in the windows. It's like a banner type thing that I put in each uh, uh, top of the cordon to decorate. And I put it there because I, I don't know what to do with it. I don't know if I should keep it or what. Maybe I keep it. I don't know. Then I have a heater there in the corner. Oh, and I forgot to talk about this here. This piece here is so nice and I have a lot of stuff there, but um, mainly what I have there is a stickers, a bunch of stickers and a bunch of things that I can send in friend mail and things like that. I put it there and I don't, I don't open it because it'll open that way and I have to move all that here in order to open because it opens that way. So yeah, but it's nothing, you know, just the stickers that I got mainly from Dollar Tree and my Jolie's Boutique stickers are there. Those are part of my sticker collection. Okay, like I said, don't be scared. This is not the most um, beautiful. It's not the most beautiful thing, but, you know. Uh, oh, it's 12 people watching. Hi, guys. Hi, hi. Hello. Thank you for being here. Um, yeah, this is my closet and because it's a craft closet and it is things that doesn't look uh, cute, don't matter how I organize, I always going to come in here and make a mess and move things around. So, you know, it's kind of hard to keep them organized, but they are organized in a way that I, um, know what is in there, what I'm looking for, you know, so let's start real quick. Um, up here it's uh, fabrics and trims and um, then I have some of these uh, long stickers from the Dollar Tree and here are my foams that I ordered from Etsy I forgot the name of the lady oh my god I, and I apologize but if I found that you guys wanted to know where they are from um, just let me know because I can share with you guys later on in another video you know the name of the shop where I get them um, yeah, and all the way back here is trims in those plastic boxes. Um, then over here, uh, this is packaging stuff like my bags and pedal boxes and zip lock, those mini zip locks, the zipper bags that we call. Um, I have them here and you guys see it's a mess. <laughs> here are projects that I'm working on and I don't finish them yet. Um, then here is some flowers and things that I use, embellishments, leaves, different things like that that I use. Oops, in my crafting, I fall off. We'll pick it up later. Uh, more in here. Um, let's see. These ones have these bags that I haul from, um, Hobby Lobby to send in friend mail and every time I send friend mail I forgot these are my um, crepe paper streamers I have those I have more here I have more here 
um, here it's these pipe cleaners, straws, um, these that I use um, to decorate around the room, um, another streamer, and then these vintage um, flowers from the race, they're very old, <laughs> you won't be able to find them anymore. Um, these are tools and these are for packaging, decoration and things like that. Uh, I ended up picking it off. Then over here, it's more packaging and I use these uh, from Dollar Tree to take pictures of my projects. Um, so there's that. And here I have more packaging stuff, my bubble mailers and tissue papers and uh, the post office. Um, flat rate envelopes and bags and all that um yarn more ribbons uh wood pieces like wooden dowels um a bunch of things guys and in the bottom it's my valentine day uh container so that looks like that and when i open the closet that's a jacket from my daughter is being near here i have stickers and paper uh, paper pads and papers and things like that I have flowers in this one and then here it's um, this uh, fuzzy um, yarn from Joann's and stores like that this is a mess with zippers and elastic but the elastic that I have is this thick thick one so um, fabrics um trims and ribbons more trims and decorations and a mess guys i i'm really sorry this is not organized these are my flowers my friend bestie carmen sent me thank you so much um here are silicone these are those ice trays but i use them for clay and different things like that um cards that you guys been sending me for so long um vintage uh decorations and things there and this one is empty so yeah more trim up there in those boxes are my lace trims and things like that so yeah um yeah that's that then here i have that mermaid and then i have um i received this the other day not too long ago and um i decide to put this here for now um and then i have my um oh my god i forgot how's it called you guys know <laughs> i forgot the name but yeah i personalize uh, that with pink crafty world i don't know if you guys can read it there but yeah it's so cute i got it at target and yeah, that's how the area looks. Again, that's me. Hi, everybody. How are you guys? Um, then I'm going to move over here. Because then I'm going to show where I actually spend my time. Where I enjoy myself. And craft when I can. And uh, lately, it's been like very hard for me. To craft because I have uh, problems with my back but you know we are hanging in there so I want to start with this side over here over here it has a bunch of my sprays um, yeah from different brands oops even my glow ble bleach uh, spray was there because I have to have it here to clean because sometimes I make huge messes um, those are like vintage and all papers and things. I don't have too much because I don't do too many vintage um, projects or anything like that. But when I need, I have that dictionary there. If I need dictionary pages and things like that. So I like to keep that. Uh, in the bottom is more of the vintage and all things. Um, then I have plastic beads in the bottom one. Um one second guys I'm, I'm sorry i'm not being reading but crafty barbie hey how are you girl thank you for stopping by 16 people watching 17 welcome guys 
thank you for being here i'm all excited to share my room with you guys uh, even though it's not the prettiest one but i just love how much space i have now uh, it's not that cluttered like my last room was like oh my god it was getting too small for me that's why i moved but like i was saying i have those plastic beads and then i have canvases there pom-poms that uh, top with the unicorn was sent to me for uh, my friend Gloria. Thank you, Gloria. Um, then I have here um, sequins from Dollar Tree, uh, empty containers, my vacuum cleaner, my mini vacuum cleaner for my desk. Um, and I have those um, Huggies wipes and things like that that I get at Dollar Tree when I make messes. And then these raggedy, ugly rags there. So when I make mess, I clean it up real quick. Um, like I said, my bleach bottle that's always there. <laughs> um, then here, my nail, they fall off. And uh, I shared this with you guys in Instagram. I make uh, my rosettes and I like to have them there ready. Um, but and now it's better because I get these containers from Dollar Tree and I have them all organized there. So, yeah, I just love it. Then here it's my memory decks um, card holder. And this is from Heidi Swap, which I love. I think it's so pretty. Uh, this is, it was meant to be trash, but it's, I used to put my... These are the ones that I recently bought, my stickers from Dollar Tree. You guys know that I'm, oh my God, I don't know what to do in my life, guys. Look at this. All these are stickers from different stores, um, you know, Hobby Lobby, um, Dollar Tree, I don't know, everywhere. <laughs> so I. this is my um, a sticker um organizer and yeah it looks like that these paper clips i love them uh, they're so cute and this was sent to me by lisa thank you lisa again um okay then i just received my coco and reno subscription today and i was trying to find out what the words um says because it's a calligraphy set but um just like my daughter came and i just leave everything in there and then I come up and I start doing the life, but it's okay. Um, here, my unicorn with the brushes. Uh, this was sent to me uh, by Gloria. Thank you, Gloria, again. Um, let's start with the top part. In the top part, you guys are gonna see, I don't know how much, you know, but it's my um, baby planters. And I use them to organize my tools here in the craft room. Like I have my jewelry making tools, my crumple dials, and my uh, corner um, chopper things from uh, We Are Memory Keepers, uh, holes punchers. Then I have a bunch of tools in this one. Um, then this one has the scissors. Um, my team holds crayons, uh, water markers, uh, the ones from Bria Reese are there. I have tools, my hammer, rollers, um, all that fun stuff, um, the tape runner from Teresa Collins, um, another tool that I have there. So that's what I use my baby planters for this is the holder for uh, my phone when i'm recording and also this one but this one is more wobbly so i make my husband put this one back he wasn't happy because he had to put it holding from the ceiling and he was like again i have to put that in the ceiling gonna get damaged but you know yeah and that's the lamp that was here the chandelier mini chandelier it's black, it doesn't match too much, but it's fine. You know, I don't need anything else here, really. Um, okay, then here in this shelf, um, uh, that I put together, that organizer there, it's from those boxes from Dollar Tree. And then I have uh, my sequence in the bottom. Um, this is a, a tape measure. Uh, this is 
tape. Um, I have here it to, this elephant is to mix my sequins when I make my sequin mixes over here. Um, then down there it's all my adhesive, or well, not all, but part of my adhesive that I'm using that I reach the most. Um, staplers, um, uh, washi champers, um, heating tool from We Are Memory Keepers, the jump rings. Um, in the bottom are more of the acrylic boxes uh, with a couple of things like uh, clip the binder clips. Then I use those, um, the green ones here, the mint greens. I use those to um, organize. When I'm die cutting, uh, like I like to separate everything so I don't get, you know, a mess and miss pieces and things. I put them in there and while I'm done doing projects, I put them in there and yeah. Um, these are the charms that I did make, the wrapping wire charms and the, my flower charms that I made. They are here. Acrylic blocks because I was using these blocks not too long ago. The pink container has adhesive and adhesive, uh, the uh, glue dots and the uh, mounting tape and adhesive like that. Uh, back there also, sorry, it's um, glue dots, tape, uh, stapler, and then I have these trinket trays um, with things. Um, this is uh, my bracelet that Anna uh, gifted to me because I'm I wanted to buy uh, a, a pink shirt but since we are in the situation we are I decide to leave it here until I get my pink shirt because next to this room is my closet so I will have it there until I get my pink shirt because I have to look pretty <laughs> um this is a phone holder these are my stamp cleaner alcohol in that bottle you know things this is the foil quill organizer. This is a sacto knife. I don't know what is here because it's supposed to be up here. Um, then I have um, here, it's these stamps that I like to collect. And um, I know you guys, a lot of you guys have been with me for a long time know that I like to collect those. And I use them in my planners. Um, and then these organizers here, of these baskets uh, my niece she bring them to me from Puerto Rico because she said oh my god when I see them they look like for your craft room they look like they're gonna be like the perfect fit that you're gonna be use them you know in your craft room and yeah she was right <laughs> um, then I have a lamp here and then this holder here it's for my iPad oh thank you G Milani creations hi um, this is for my iPad, so when I go live, I put my iPad here so I can read you guys. But since today, um, I'm being, you know, busy with moving around, so I can, uh, I decide not to have the iPad, but yeah. Then this is my, um, uh, hot glue gun holder. I get this at Joanne, and um, yeah, I love that thing. That's the perfect thing to have. Um, then down here, I have here uh, my Fisker um, cutter, paper trimmer. And then this organizer here, I have to spray paint it, but because of the weather here in Ohio, we still having a snow guys. So, oh my goodness. But um, this one I have here on uh, my I scraps of papers um, so I have them I did have them organized by color like one folder was pink or there was orange and yellows and greens and so on but I don't know I'm being lately I'm being just throwing everything in there and yeah bad girl but and then here in the bottom are my papers like my cardstock papers so yeah and um, yeah, I have those um, magnets again from Dollar Tree. This here, it's my uh, fuse tool. 
And then this was made by my friend Gloria and she sent it to me. And I have a bunch of cables and mess, but that's how I, that's the best I can do. Um, my heating tool. And then I have here another cart. And I'm going to turn it around. Um, this is my other cart that I have. And in this cart, in top, I have my more adhesive and some of my mediums. Like this is decoupage um, glue. Um, I have my triple thick. Um, I have these, um, the embellishments, the gold flakes. Um, yeah, more adhesive from everywhere. My tag, my fabric tag that I love. Um, markers, my bottle, spray bottle, water bottle spray. Uh, there, some, um, die cuts from Team Holtz. And then when I die cut and I have leftovers, I sometimes I put them in this here. Um, so yeah, here is some from Heidi Swap. Yeah, and then in the bottom here, I have more um, punchers, those um, small ones. I have my memory decks puncher also and different, you know, punchers and you know, the ones that I reach, um, for the most part, you know, and then I have my ATG gun here, my big crocodile here, and my tape, um, for packaging, these hold my rolls of tape, and then in the bottom, it's, um, uh, no books, um, no pads, and then I have mini bags here, um, these are bow maker from EK Tools. These are from Recollections and they are to make shakers. Um, I have Happy Jig stuff there. Um, yeah, embellishments and doilies I have there. And because I read um, a lot for those things, I keep them in there. And yeah, that's how they look. And again, I decorate my card with... Um, the magnets, um, ones are sent for me. Some of you guys send them. Like Anna, she sent me these ones here. And they're so pretty. This was gifted to me by Lisa. Um, yeah, so my bat. And then here in this keychain, I have my uh, foil quill. Um, the memory flash drives for the foil quill. And then, uh, let me move this out of here. Those are cards, um, powder, baby powder, and I use that to remove adhesive. You guys know that. Um, those are things that I use to send uh, back and send sometimes in friend mail. And um, in the bottom also, like, you know, notebooks, um, uh, notepads and things like that are in there these are journals and books this is a Winnie the Pooh book oops sorry Winnie the Pooh book here that I love and those are vintage cards and I have them there because they're cute um then over here is an organizer and in this organizer I have a bunch of different things um Tassels and trim and yeah, wooden pieces that I like to put in mail. This uh, I use this as a stencil. My friend Dana sent me those. Um, here is more embellishments. You guys see and the flat back pearls and gems, the sticky gems and things like that. So I have those there. And that's a picture of my daughter when she graduated from high school with the band. Uh, I was a band man all my high school years of, with my son and my daughter. So, yeah. And then I have these here. Uh, I found them. And these are cute carousels. So I have this one here. And in the other side, it's another one. But, yeah, that's how these 
um, desk look. Now I'm gonna go um, in the back. And like I said, is here it's a carousel. And then in these cups, I have um, pencils and pens. They are so cute, I love them. Then here I put this um, uh, from Dollar Tree and they hold my Cricut mats and my um, brother scan and design and cut mat. So I have those there. And then my lights um, when I record or anything like that. Okay. And yeah, that's how this looks. Let's. Um, oh, thank you, Lisa. Hi. <laughs> um, then I have here my TV because sometimes if I don't listen to the radio or podcast or anything like that. in the that, oh yeah, yeah. wait a minute I'm trying to read you guys it's just like so hard because my phone don't let me my phone is kind of in the way so yeah and I hope I'm not pressing anything can you guys uh, listen to me good like just let me know I, I'm gonna be moving this because I'm trying to adjust this here gosh okay okay let's continue um i have the tv there and then this organizer here um that has a bunch of embellishment guys to the point that i can open that very well if i open that right now oh my goodness uh, it can fall apart oh thank you thank you i try you know i think this room is is being um a nice change for me because it's bigger so yeah i'm very very happy um that i you know have more space to walk around and not to feel uh all you know crowded there so yeah oh 16 people watching thank you so much guys how are you guys um, let's continue. So yeah, that has flowers there and like um, adhesive dots, um, but it's mainly flowers. Um, I love to have flowers and every time I run low, I have to get more and more and more. So then I hang those things there. They're from Dollar Tree and that one with the paper flowers I made. This one here, but it looks all funky now because I don't know. I don't know. But it's cute. I like it. I make that. <laughs> so then this piece here, this uh, wood creation, let me call it like that. It was from my husband. He actually made that for me so I can put my paper pads. And I have so many guys before I moved to this room that I said, you know, I have to get rid of a lot. And I did. I did get rid of a lot of stuff. And you know, not everything that is there is paper. I have to, you know, make that clear. Um, but, you know, like I have my letter board there and other things that there it's not paper. But, you know, they fit there. So I just leave them there. And that's how they look. It's pretty much what I have there is my craft smart papers and my recollection papers and the hat buy papers. Um, yeah, those are there. Okay, then we have this a shelving unit here. Okay. And we're going to start from the top part. The top part, I have some decorations there. My thumbs up. So guys, don't forget to thumbs up this uh, live. If you guys like what you guys are seeing, please thumb up. Oh, these fall off, of course. These are my... Some of my likes here already. Oh, you know what? I'm going to have to leave it hanging for now. And I will take care of that later. But anyway. And this is my favorite shelf. It looks like candy there. It's so pretty. <laughs> but there I have like my Nouveau Drops, my Liquid Pearls, my uh, Glitterifics, my Stickles. Um, 
I have these um, foil things that I use to embellish sometimes. Um, you know, I got these two recently from the Little Birdie haul. I have my angel, uh, tarot angel sprays there. Uh, my uh, smooches sprays. Uh, my watercolors. Um, these are from the Dollar Tree. This glitter glue. And this glitter glue is uh, better than this from the Crafter Square. I have to say that. I have some Bow Bunny. I have the sparkles from the Little Birdie. I have these tiny sequins here. Um, different shapes. I got those at Target. Like, I think a lot of them are from Target. Um, these, I love these. This is a... Uh, German glass. Oh, sorry. It, this is German glass that uh, my friend uh, Dana. Thank you, Dana. She sent me that for Christmas, and I love that. I love, love the the way things looks when you put them in flowers and things like that. Oh, I love that. And I also love the diamond dust here. I have more of the gold flakes, and then these are alcohol inks that I create my own using. Um, permanent markers um, then here in the second shelf I have two uh, some are open some I don't use them yet but if I see them and I see color that I like yes I get them and then I have my stamping um, pads these are very old they are from the stamping up and they are retired but they are so juicy they still have so much juice and they stamp better than any other stamp i have i'm telling you so yeah and i have some wooden stamp here this one lisa sent me thank you lisa again i have them here and i use them a lot i have my um other um, stamps here the, the stamp inks and these are the color wheels from uh, Vicky Button. I have this and I have the blue and green down there. Um, another set of stamps here. More stamps from uh, Recollection and Target. Um, here are some of my archival and my distress inks. And then this box is like the ones that I alter from... Um, uh, this is from Hobby Lobby, and I altered those other three with, um, what is it called? The Maggie Holmes <laughs> papers. And I have to still to do this one, but, you know, I just didn't this one yet. But it has more um, stamp pads, um, ink pads, and different brands, um, different colors. Yeah some new some old same thing here i have some archival some distress um the uh, color box the hampton art things like that then down here this is like an album but what it has there it's um die cuts and then this beautiful mermaid book it was sent to me by Carmen, thank you, Carmen, again for sending me. It's so pretty that book. It's just gorgeous. I just love it. Then in this here, I have a lot of stuff. Like I have these feathers and bottles, um, bottles to send um, friend mail and things there. And I have like a picture frame, those mini ones that I alter, and projects that I'm been working on. And then I have uh, boxes here, um, the box that Anna sent me. Thank you, Anna. And then I have this one here uh, with pom-poms, mini pom-poms. I have them in there. And then those there has uh, flowers that I make with ribbons, handmade flowers and butterflies. And then this is to make an organizer but I don't get to do that yet. <laughs> so, surprise, surprise. Here, it's these um, doilies. I use them sometimes. Sometimes I 
have them here and I don't know I just love them so much I just yeah try I don't know who is 19 people watching hi everybody thank you for being here um so yes that there here I have like um more of these um, shadow boxes and letters and tools nothing nothing fancy nothing nice to look at nothing that really happy to look for you know i have those pictures from dollar tree with the sequence here um because i wanted to put them somewhere in the room but i don't know where i don't have the space i have these binders and yeah new boxes those acrylic boxes from dollar tree then here i have more of the um uh fairy garden things from dollar tree yeah and my water colors is in there okay and now let's go to the other shelf unit is this one here it's another one that i love so much and there I have a basket, ceramic basket, um, this uh, tent um, box. I just love it so much. It's so cute, so vintagey. Oh, I love it. <laughs> and I have those boxes there. It has my Christmas tree. And the other one, I think I empty it. It has nothing, but I like to keep it there just because it's cute and I alter it. I mean, and then here I have this bottle i just recently got them from dollar tree and they're not supposed to be here but i just put them in here for now um because my bathroom is under construction and i'm gonna make something for my bathroom with those um i'm thinking uh, if i don't uh, find the other ones with the um like seashells and things i will use those but here i have embellishments um that i got at aliexpress buttons um, my straws more straws here in this uh, flower vase and then here are more embellishments and knickknacks to decorate little flowers you know bunch of things that i just like to have in case i need them for my craft my crafting you know then this was in my uh, previous room and I also make this like a um, hanging thing and it's so cute um it's not supposed to be there because it doesn't look good there but um until I can move it to somewhere else I decide to hang it there because I don't want these pieces to get broke since they are vintage um Oh, guys, I wish I can be reading you guys. <laughs> but if I read you guys, I won't be able to. Oh, it's 21 people watching. Hey, everyone. Hi. Thank you for stopping by. Um, Let's continue. Then here. Oh, my God. Okay. Here I have this organizer. And I have these are the containers from Dollar Tree. And what I do is I paint the lids in the colors that I like, of course, pink and aqua. And uh, um, I put my, my flat back pearls, my beads, um, more beads and things like that from Dollar Tree flowers or from Michaels or, you know, whatever I found things. Then I have these ones here. Those have the confetti um, that I get from Hobby Lobby on sale. I have bows in this one. Um, I have flowers and I have those balls for packaging there. Uh, flat jams in there. Uh, yeah, the more of the flat jams in here. These ones, these three here, I have to paint them. Um, and this one also, I have to paint the lids, but since the weather is not cooperating with me, I have to be like, you know, waiting. Here it's mm, a potpourri of different things from books, uh, from things that I use in my, um, if I make journals or I make vintage stuff, I have my stencils here. 
a bunch of stencils that are in this one. Um, this is a coloring book. Um, uh, book. I think this was sent to me by Dana. A uh, paper that Dana gave to me for Christmas. Um, different things. Things I found. Things I bought. You know. Those cute organizers. Um, I get them at Dollar Tree. Oh. Um. And then um, here are, I don't know, these um, bags that I like to send more of these, um, um, the microfiber cloth from Dollar Tree because I like to use them for pictures and things like that. Um, Easter, uh, things from Dollar Tree to decorate for red mail and things um this is things that i put here to you know if i make um these type of embellishment boxes i have here uh, these notepads um, these bottles i like to put sometimes sequin mixes on them so i have them here uh so when i need for friend mail i have them there um this one is more packaging items for friend mail. Ones that I recycle, ones that I bought. Here it's wooden, my wooden pieces, uh, foam cones, uh, trays, um, boxes. Got a lot of bunch of tools and stuff there. You know, it's a mess. Um, yeah, up there is ear, of course. You're going to be there. My sweet, beautiful closet that Carmen sent me. Thank you, Carmen, again. Um, Hobby bought me the ball, in, and it's so cute. It's like a llama, um, and it's this plush. It's a llama, and it's so cute. That box I made, I have a tutorial on the channel on how to create the accordion box. Um, I Behind that, it's uh, Winnie the Pooh. Um, picture holder and then the doll that my friend uh carmen thank you carmen bestie sent me that and i love it um and then this is the other shelf unit that i have here so cute so, um here i have the foam flowers uh paper flowers in those acrylic containers there then i found a dollar tree the other day those butterflies and you guys know i love butterflies so i decided to grab them and then here it's a bunch of different trims trims and trims that i get from ali pom pom trims these trims oh gosh trims and trims <laughs> anyway uh here these baskets these metal baskets that i get at the container store uh, they are so cute they're pink and i have all my uh, eyelash trims. Uh, gosh, I have a lot of the eyelash trim and I give a lot to a lot of people, you know? So, but you guys know, the uh, eyelash trim can last you for one spool of that. It's just like a lot. Oh my God, we got 26 people watching. Hello, hello guys. Don't forget to thumbs up. Um, but yes, that has all my eyelash trims and trims like that that looks like eyelash and or something similar. Um, they are all in that shelf. And then in this shelf is like things that a lot of you guys gifted to me, like my friend Carrie. Hi, Carrie. Um, she made me that uh, mini album and I love it so much and I display it there. Um, my husband got me some of the stuff. Um, I love her. She's actually uh, a collective piece and it's uh, an antique collective piece. Um, this cutesy here was from my friend um, Carmen. Thank you, Carmen. I love that. Girl, I love that. Um, back there, I have that other vintage uh, thing. And um, these are uh, tea lights holder, but they look so cute. So, yes. Um, 
Then in this, I have a Holy Bible and it's a, a very old um, Bible, but I like to have it here in my room. Um, sometimes if I don't go and grab or I don't want to read uh, from the phone, I just grab this one and I just do my journaling, my Bible journaling or my meditations, my prayers, everything you want to call it. I do it here in my craft room where I'm by myself when I feel happy and all that good stuff. Oh, sorry guys, I didn't move my, this is my tripod. And I like to keep it like that because sometimes um, here I have these containers. Um, they're glass containers and I altered the lids, of course, you know, put a cute trim. And I have those um, pearl trims and different colors here are ribbons and trims in this other one here um that one has glue sticks and buttons and more of the pearl um trims there my scissors uh, once they're cut in different shapes and are in this glass milk uh, I love glass milk. I'm a collector of glass milk. So I remove a lot of them from my craft room because I need the space for my actual crafting. But I just love that one was uh, push it back because I don't want it to get broke. Yeah. And it's so beautiful. I just love that piece. Um, that's my family there. And that was gifted to me by my friend Kerry. Thank you so much, Kerry. I love that uh so much then i have my bubble gums machines and i have the pink one i altered that one and i'm gonna get closer so you guys can see i put applicates and yeah that's how it looks and then i have these vintage uh ceramic ladies here that i love them so much um and that piece of um china mini cabinet thing <laughs> and yeah that's how that looks oh yeah i'll go to that part in a bit um but yes and then in the bottom part um i paint this this was brown colored wood like and i didn't like the color i wanted everything all the furniture to be white and you know i paint it and it was so much fun to paint it. Oh my goodness. Um, and it's not perfect. The inside I didn't paint because nobody going to look actually the inside but me. And I I, and I paint the um, pieces you guys see and inside it's brown. So yeah, I have there my, I have trims. I have more boxes and things there. I have um, more stamps and I have my uh crafter companion um cards boxes there with some materials and i have brushes that container there has my um uh, vintage buttons and i love them and here is my bowl dabra and some lids for mason jars and sponges and things like that not too many things there to you know uh to be you know Nothing interesting, I should say. Okay, so sorry guys if I'm making you dizzy, but oh, I forgot to mention here is the other carousel. I don't know if I shared that with you guys, but that's, yeah, I have one in each end of the desk organizer. Okay, now to the fun part. <laughs> what my husband have a really really headache building was this shelving unit and this has a huge oh my god it, it was a history here um after we built and i i was like organized and the best i can you know uh, because maybe it doesn't look too organized but to me it's it's pretty decent pretty organized oh hi dana how are you um he built that and after he built that one day when he started building the bathroom re, you know remodeling the bathroom he came up here to 
uh, put those cabinets. I have one cabinet here and one cabinet there. And we noticed that that was falling apart, was coming off the wall. So he had to run through to the Home Depot and, you know, I have to empty everything before my machines fell. And it, it was a total experience for a Sunday morning. So, yeah, um, now it's very safe and it looks so nice. I love that area of my room. I have to say, I think it's my favorite area in the whole room. It's that wall <laughs> why because they have the things that i love the most and let's start i'm gonna start from top to bottom again i have that cute banner that my sweet sweet friend uh my bestie carmen sent me and it says maria my name for the ones who don't know my name is maria hi carrie um and uh yeah I put that banner there and then I have the house. It's a shelving unit and I'm gonna share with you guys. It's a, it's like a, a shelving organizer. Um, let me open it and yeah, here I have my paints, my acrylic paints and I organize them by color and I think it looks pretty. And these are sprays that I made uh, with, um, acrylic uh, paint and these organizers here doesn't have anything they're empty uh, and I put them there because I wanted to paint them and do something you know uh, maybe to send in friend mail or you know whatever I get inspired to do with them uh, let me close it and yeah that's how that one look I painted it I paint the outside the inside I didn't paint it uh, it's white anyway so I decide not to paint it. Then I have these picture frames and these picture frames are with me since I was in the basement. My craft room was in the basement and um, I just um, keep them and I decide to reuse them here. And then I have fairies hanging there and they are so cute. I have these fairies for, oh my God, years now. And you know, I didn't have nowhere to display them. And I decide, let me bring them back and, you know, put them in my craft room. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. It's 28 people watching. Hi, everyone. Thank you for being here. I'm so happy. Um, okay. So, yeah. Then I get uh, stickers from, oh, Margarita. Hi, Margarita. This Mama Love Disney. Hi. Oh my God, if I don't say hi to everybody, excuse me, but it's hard to, you know, do, share, show you guys everything and read the comments. So, but be sure that after I done with the live, I will be reading you. Um, But again, I put those stickers from the Dollar Tree there and I think they look very pretty. And my husband built me, uh, not built me, he put the cabinets here. And then over here, before I open that, over here, um, this has my mediums, have gelatos, it has some acrylic paints from Prima, um, the paste, um, these paste are from what brand? I forgot. <laughs> uh, from Breweries. I have a bunch of paste there. I throw them, I throw a lot of them away because I use them and they, they was getting dry and, you know, I have my uh, gel medium. Um, my matte gel medium, my acrylic paints, a bunch of stuff um, there. So then I have my handkerchief. Somebody mentioned that the handkerchief is so cute. So thank you so much. Yeah, they are very old and I have them and I, then I decide to hang them from there. And I think they look adorable. Then I get this basket here from the Dollar Tree and um because I wanted to buy one of those uh, organizers for the uh, vinyls, but uh, they are so expensive. So I just like, I have to go with something that are more cheaper. I don't have that many, that's all what I have. So, you know, I know everything that is there is vinyl. So, you know, I decide just to go um, with that one. Then I have here, um, 
let me move this i have here this beautiful 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 again um oh my god i just mentioned fairy and um i had to take them off because i did i run out of space um to put it in the wall so i'm just i don't know what i'm gonna do but i love her so much so i'm scared that she get broke but uh I don't know. It's there for now. So I'm going to move it. Then I have this card. This card has some of my project lives. And it has some of my jewelry making stuff. Also have some pom poms and beads and flap jam. Um, these flap jam things from Hobby Lobby. Again, pom poms and all that fun things are in there. And yeah. Okay. Now going in here let's go to this cabinet which is a mess i have more cards you guys send me in here i have mink uh, stuff to work with my mink i have my uh, silicone molds here cards that i made that i have them so when i need to send somebody i have and some little notebooks and things in there and um, what else oh i have twine in that box and these two boxes in the bottom are empty um just waiting for the stores to get open so i can fill them up <laughs> guys i'm joking <laughs> um that here this cute 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 organizer here um lisa gonna recognize that because she gifted to me thank you so much lisa uh, then this is a glass milk basket ceramic and uh, yeah I'm very careful with that because i don't want to get broke and then here i have my machines that's my cricut this is my design and cut my little sizzix there my um how is it called the one from tim holtz the sidekick and my uh sizzix expression is there this birdhouse, you guys recognize that because I shared that not too long ago. I made that from scratch and I think I did an awesome job in my birdhouse. Isn't look that so cute? Okay, then here is this other cabinet and in this cabinet I have, and then I have here all my uh, die cutting plates uh, for my machines and uh, paper trimmers here. So when I work on some scissors, uh, because when I'm here, oh, guys, okay, can you guys see me? Somebody can tell me if you guys can see again, because uh, something went wrong, and I don't know. Yes, okay, thank you, and I'm sorry about that. Hi, Anna. Thank you, Anna. <laughs> so, yeah, I was talking about this, so that's what I have in here. And um, there is a, it's a basket from Easter from the Dollar Tree. But um, I just put it, put it back and I put like when I cut, I cut, you know, all the pieces of paper that I'm going to use, I throw them in there and then I throw in the big, big trash can that I have there. So yeah, that's my, my cis expression. It's here. Uh, this was gifted to me by my husband, and I love it so much. And again, I make covers for my machines. Uh, my design and cut, it's here. And I love this machine. This machine is so user-friendly. Oh, my goodness. I just love it. And I make that cover. And here, it's my cut. And, yeah, that's how it looks. So, I love, love my machines. Then... In the second shelf, right there, I have more papers, but these papers are collections. I have Prima, I have tools, I have Prima, I have um, Pink Paisley, I have the Snow and Coco. Um, these are all here are my Maggie Holmes. Um, I have, um, mink, um, uh, items like this is a stuff for the mink. These are the foils for the mink. Um, uh, my bow bunny 
are in these two. I have Bow Bunny. These are Jen Hatfields and other collections from Crate Paper. This one here holds my six by six uh, paper packs. Um, they are in this uh, container. Then I have this here that has my um, tools that I take in the go. Like if I go in the car, you know, for a long time, I just uh, go and uh, take this with me. So, yeah, and here it's like I said, this has all my six by six um, paper pads that it's not, you know, that I don't have um, too many things from these collections or the glitter ones or colors, you know, like I have. These are the glitter ones back here. Things like that. You know. Some are from Bow Bunny from different collections. These fuse balls from We Are Memory Keepers. These Sizzix ones. All these fun stuff. They fit perfectly in these containers. And this container is from the R bin. I think it is. Yeah. So. Um, over here, I have the little birdie, and I have, uh, I think this is the all hearts, and uh, I forgot this one is maybe more of the Jen Hatfield. Okay, then the third shelf, the third shelf, um, is, um, my containers that I got from the Harbor Freight that they take forever to come. And the other two my husband got me. Some are from the Dollar Tree in the bottom over there. Um, oh, Lisa, you're leaving. Bye, Lisa. Thank you for stopping by, sweetheart. Thank you, thank you. Um, yeah, I have my laminator machine down there. It's all in the back. I have my texture boutique um, machine there. More organizer containers. I have my beads from Hobby Lobby are in there. And then in these pink and blue containers here, um, they are from uh, Dollar Tree. And I have a bunch of stuff. Like this one has uh, a bunch of ribbons. And my other heating tool that was disappeared. And that's because that one disappeared. I bought a new one. And then as soon as I buy the new one, that one show up in my room. I don't know how. Don't ask me. <laughs> I'm not crazy. <laughs> um, yeah, I have a bunch of ribbons there from different stores. Dollar Tree, Hobby Lobby everywhere walmart everywhere I can find them then i have these um pom pom beads there and i have um the puzzle pieces um and i have uh, more things to you know organize or to send you know maybe sequin mixes or things like that this brush organizer that i just got at dollar tree is there then in here, it's more of these organizers from um, Dollar Tree, these uh, foam balls and the confetti, more of the confetti glass beads there and my sequins there. Yeah. And then I have some wooden pieces there and some empty containers. And then I have my Platinum 6. It's that one there with the cover. So then in the floor, in those boxes in the floor, um, I have, uh, okay, the first one has some uh, planner items. Um, that one has more ribbons and stuff like that. The unicorn box has all uh, related to Christmas. Um, that one there, the round box there has, um, my, oh my God, what is it called? 
that we use to make tassels with that. <laughs> but that type of trims, those uh, mini uh, things of trims there. Um, and then the one uh, in the corner there, that one is empty. And I believe um, this one here, I got it from Hobby Lobby, is empty. And this one has those. A bunch of those so when I need to make tassels any colors they are there and I just have to grab them and make them and be good to go and yes guys I believe that we are now finished with um, this craft room tour reveal um, I hope that you guys like it it's been a lot of talking, <laughs> um, but like I said, you know, I'm very, very happy. Um, I'm going to move back again little by little. I've been very, very happy since I moved to this room because, you know, I have tons of, of space, guys. Look at all the space that I have. And I know it did take me forever to, um, you know, the... Um, do the live or a video on this craft room because you know in oh, sorry if i make noises um because in my mind i was like okay i wanted to show maybe in my mind the perfect room for me um but i know it's never going to be perfect because in order to be perfect i have to be able not to touch anything and it's not the case this is where i spend uh a lot of times during the day you know sometimes i don't come here at all but sometimes i do and i enjoy it and oh my god it's so so fun you know it's just i love crafting and yeah i just even though i craft sometimes i don't share what i make um but this is me again hi guys yes yes i have a meter here for the ones who show up late that's the closet and i have those middle wall, um, doors there and yes hi, hi. <laughs> um but like i was saying you know i was like wait a minute i never gonna have a perfect room because and any any which way i don't want it to be perfect either you know i want to be uh clean organized yes and be able to find anything i want you know that i know it's uh, i put this there and it have to be there you know it's just like and again you know i'm just very proud i put a lot of work onto this room uh, to move all this stuff it wasn't easy um and you know husband helped me a lot um but yeah, it, it, it is what it is. And I'm very, 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 very happy with the results. Um, I have, um, you know, what I like and what I enjoy. And that's that's pretty much uh, what it matters, right? <laughs> as long as you love your space, even you can be in a little tiny table in a little tiny area. But if it's your area and you love it, um, you're going to enjoy. So, yeah guys i cannot stress anymore how thankful i am how grateful i am of every single one of you guys today i find out that we are three thousands finally we are three thousand in this channel so yay i'm so so happy for that and without you guys this won't be possible so thank you so much for the support thank you so much for your friendship you know i I consider every single one of you guys my friend and I love every single one of you guys and you know I pray for you day and night and I hope everybody is safe and healthy and keep going strong don't lose faith this will pass and I know God will have something very nice for all of us and you know um, I'm very happy to to share my joy and to share what I have and what I have is not only mine it's yours and 
again i this won't be possible without any any of you guys so um i'm gonna switch the camera over here because i'm talking i'm talking and you know you guys cannot see me let me move this to a side um but yes i'm very very thankful very grateful i'm very happy of every single one of you guys um you guys are the best uh keep crafting um don't let paper crafting go away for nothing in the world you know stay crafting stay possible thank you so so much many many hugs bunch of kisses uh thank you for stopping by and giving me all the support and all the love and i will be you know here in another crafty video guys so thank you so much many blessings and goodbye now bye bye